Hi guys, my name is Meat. I got a package today, and uh, this is actually from Sinju or Sinjui. <laughs> and uh, he mentioned that if I'm be willing to partake on this awesome Sinju crate activity, and of course you cannot say no to that. And so basically, I got a package. I came from Chicago. Hmm. I took delivery to hide our identities. <laughs> Unfortunately, this got damaged. Uh, I'm not sure if the mailman or someone from the carrier uh, might have hit it. Hopefully, everything is still fine inside. Alright, so I already took the liberty of removing the first tape. Let's see what's inside. Oh, okay. So that's well packaged. I got some. That's crazy. Alright, let's take a look at this letter here. Hello there, welcome to the Shinjui Crate. What is the Shinjui Crate you might ask? It's just a box of stuff. <laughs> Alright, let's get to the good stuff. Here is your build-off kit. I'm sorry it's not super good, but I wanted something that will work as a stress reliever for all your, all you working on big kits for, for like contests and whatnot. Also, I couldn't afford much with my birthday money. Oh. Alright, enjoy the kit and like... I'll add some simple rules for the build off on the back. Okay. You know, knowing that the, this whole crate comes from his birthday money, that's that's awesome. Build off rules. Please have fun. Will do. Do whatever you like to the kit. Make it as cartoony as you like or realistic as you like. As many mods as you can throw on it or none at all. That's what it, as long as it uh, looks good at the end. Okay. Deadline whenever I guess. Get your creative juices going. That's it. No more rules. Just enjoy. Okay. I can do whatever I want with it. And yeah. Just make your own custom basically. Okay. Getting back to the box. Let's see what's inside. Ooh. Nicely packaged. Oh, this is probably the gift or the kit inside. All right, so let's open this first. This is interesting, kind of exciting. Ooh, what is this? Oh, it's a Guerrero Gunso Sergeant Frog. Wow, nice. I got a few of these. Oh, that's cool. And all right, so I, I have something to go along with my other Sergeant Frog kits. All right, I will, I'll be working on this. Pretty cool. I'm um, just wondering. Oh yeah, it's. I think I have the. Which one? I have the. Was it the blue one? No, I think it was the enemy. It was the snake. So that's great. Let's put that there. Let's move this. What is this? Looks like a message. You watch too many pirate movies. This is in a false bottom. <laughs> I found a candy. Ooh, it's the grape gummy uh, candy. Cool. But you know what? I'm gonna go eat this while I'm continuing my unboxing. Yum. Mmm. Alright. What is this? <laughs> oh, bang. Okay. <laughs> All wrapped up in. Oh, cool. Okay, let's let's open this one first. That's a lot of back of goodies. Uh oh. Come on. <laughs> ah. Cinnamon lip balm. I think I know where you got this. <laughs> I have the, the same one. Cool. 
stuff unlocked there just some extra stuff from a good guy so it's not much but right out of birthday money there is some pretty good stuff in here so enjoy yep oh this one it's looking for snacks finally got one i think i've tried this before it's chicken flavored crackers Oh, candy! Is this the... It's like a... Yeah, the plum. Dried plum. I love those. Thanks! I got three of them. A lot of candy. Okay, this is a different one. <laughs> I really need to go to an Asian market store and... Grab a lot of Asian candies. Ooh, gosh upon. Oh, I wanted one of these. Every time I go to Yings, they have a lot of gosh upon in display. Unfortunately, I cannot open this with one hand. And I cannot open it. All. Hold on, let me open this. All right, so inside. I'm not sure what this is, but. It's, all right. Let's see. I got parts and parts and that's some weird Gundam there. I cannot make of this. I'm not too sure what this one is. Okay. Uh, hoping that uh, they will tell me. Oops, sorry. I, my my camera's not focusing right now. It's fixed. But uh, let's see. Um, from the picture, no, it's not the strike or any of those. It doesn't have the shield. I actually don't know what it is. Actually, hold on. Let me see the. It's a red torso. It's like a special one. It's a red torso right there, and yeah, I actually don't know what kind of Gundam that is. None of these have a red torso, so it might be the mystery one. Actually, kind of want to get that red lander right there, or the ball. Hmm. I think this is the dragon one or something. I'm not sure. All right, I'll build it later on. Actually, might as well build it now. All right, and uh, might as well show how I build it. So first off, um, seems like straightforward. We have a joint there for the shoulder, uh, for the stand, and some kind of weird. Oh, okay. If, I guess if you, if you have this version here. Just looking back here again. That looks really cool. It seems like it's from the, the Night Gundam. You have like the Spear Dragon here, I think. Seems like it. And this looks like the camphor. Nice. But I'm still not sure what the Gundam is this. So, uh, why don't we get into it? So, first off, it's noticeable we put the Viv in first. And you get that soft rubber, which. It's bent the other way. <laughs> Might have to heat it up or something, but nonetheless, I'll probably just leave it like that. All right, put in the torso. All right, already uh, attached this one together. It's actually on a three that we each you just uh, remove. So it's like building a small kit. <laughs> Next up, the sh uh, the arms. So. Uh, there's actually a little R in there, it tells you where which one goes to, so right hand, or you can see from the hands, and here also. Next part are these little things, or actually kind of big, but the great thing about this is there are peg uh, specific, so you get the large, medium, small. I thought this was large, but actually it's this one right here. This is the large one, goes on the back, I think. Alright, might have missed them. 
Oh, hopefully I didn't mi mix them up. But I kind of like that uh, where the, this one's a lot, uh, the big, uh, bigger side goes in front. It kind of reminds me of the full cloth. And it would be cool to know what this Gundam is or where it came from. Nonetheless, it looks amazing. I always wanted to get one of these. This is my first one, so. That's great. I kind of wish I can buy some more of this or know which. Yeah, where to get them. Although I kind of don't want to start <laughs> collecting them. I may end up getting to that point, but it's good to just try it out. And uh, thanks, Andrew, for letting me try it. Try this one. I I always wanted to give a shot. Getting this on, so we're on to the waist, to the feet, and we're almost there. Surprisingly, for something this size, a gosh upon, it's quite articulated. You get the neck. You have the elbow, which swivels, and you have the shoulder, which is very articulate because of that joint. You have the waist, and you have the leg. You know, for a super deformed, that's pretty cool. And this makes great uh, game pieces also. And I just wish they were more available. There we go. Nice. All right, and let's get back to Sinju's crate. All right, so what else is inside? Oh wait, is this another Gashapon? No, it look, it's a little squishy. So, oh, another one. Ah, see, I know where you're getting this. I got the same one. Loot crate. Cool. I have two now. All right. I thought you had the same idea. I was, I'm getting a lot of the salute crate and eventually I kind of just want to give it away. There are a few that I want to keep, but there's actually a lot more that I want to just give away. What is this? I'm getting there. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm trying to remember which loot crate this is. I think it's the zombie one. Yep. Alright. Oh, I need to change battery. Be right back. Alright, so we got that part. Um, is this a candy? It looks like a box. Oh, I'm thinking it's a candy. Snappers. Oh, okay. It's not, definitely not a candy. Okay, I had this before. Where you just said uh, it's a small little pa Oh, I shouldn't drop that. <laughs> Maybe that's what happened on the side of the box. Someone dropped the box and just exploded. Ooh, nicely wrapped again. There's a cat. But those are a little. Uh, <clears throat> Like little gunpowder and like small, uh, like napkin. It's really small with a thread, and you just throw it. All right, Space Invaders. I don't think this is, is this look great. I don't know. Interesting. Let's look what's inside. Open it. <clears throat> what did I get? So we get a UFO, an alien. Wait, wait. So we get a UFO, squid, crab, octopus, cannon. I'm not sure what I got. This is a cannon. Yep. And it's magnetized. Sweet. All right, I'm gonna put that on my lamp. <laughs> I tend to put all my magnets on the lamps. Cool. Okay. I 
wish I got something else. Like the octopus or the alien. But not complaining there. I got more of this squishy. Oh, this is the sticky one. Hold on. I hope it's not sticky. Why would you put it in your newspaper? <laughs> Why would you put it there? Oh, yes. He did put it there. So it's that squishy thing. <laughs> Alright. A fun stress reliever. Hence, it's on the, uh, on the theme of his box. Things he built just relieve stress. Okay, Let's see this. Oh! Oh, you get this one. It's from Simpson. Or is it Futurama? I can't remember anymore. Nice. So remember, I got the robot. And you got more stuff here. So, you got the, the jello, more grape. I'm just going to leave it down there. What is this? Oh, a dice. I've been on the lookout for dices. Nice. So still working on that game. I think of a game with dice. So much stuff here, man. <laughs> Jeez. Oh. Got them converge. You also took an effort to wrap every single one. Uh, I give you props. It's just Alright, Big Nagina. Sweet. A friend of mine likes this suit and he actually got the Gundam Converge. It's a really nice metallic silver and you got some purple. It's really nice. Thanks. Um, I'm gonna save this for later. Yep, we'll save that for later. More stuff. We, we, we have a lot of stuff here already. This just keeps coming. Oh, this is nice. The chibi figures. Sweet. Godzilla. We got Mecha Godzilla here. And you got the other ones in the back. Cool. Nice. I think I would get either Mothra or Godzilla too. Eh, the other one destroy it. Mm. See, all of them are cool except for Gigan there. Why is he green? Nice. Awesome. And this thing is just. There's another layer down there. <laughs> oh. I think that's it. We reached the bottom of Sinju's crate. Oh, I just realized he, he taped the sides. Again, we got more candies here. Alright, that's great. That's a lot of stuff. That's awesome, man. You no, know, actually, I kind of wish there's a kind of like a loot crate for Japanese stuff because a, a lot of stuff I collect are Japanese related. So, you know, this is great. It's just amazing. Nice. Some of the things I, I've already known. But uh, having this is awesome. Um, also, this one. So I like this one. These are kind of salty, dried plum, but they're actually good once you get the hang of it. <laughs> All right, that is the crate from Sinjui. I got my letter here. I'm gonna work on this kit. Hey, man, thanks very much. This is awesome. This is quite a treat. And yeah, that's about it for the review. Also, I'm going to put the link down below. Check out Sinjui. Yeah, some cooler uh, videos. Otherwise, um, yeah. Till then, this is Meads. Thanks for watching.